Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to another episode of Let's Play Dark Chronicle. Hope you're all having a wonderful day. In the last episode, we took a picture of the Lafracia stem, as well as made it to the roadblock in the main dungeon that we're working on in Venicio. Uh, and we still have the picture of a Lafracia stem, which will help us out uh, when talking to Claire, as Rowan has uh, pointed out that we need Claire for the next uh, area. So we might as well go do that. Uh, she's the daughter of Mayor Need. Don't channel, and uh, she also works at the cafe, and happens to live right across from Max. So I don't know exactly where the cafe is. I think it's down this way, the opposite side of where the uh, fishing stuff would go on. Uh, so I'm curious to see if it's over here, because we got the bar, and then uh, there's coffee here, but not cafe. So what's the difference, dude? What's the difference? Unless in Japan, bar is cafe, which I totally doubt, but you know, could definitely be. So we'll just figure it out. Alright, anyone, anyone important? Nope. Nobody. Okay. I'll be right back. I'll go see if I can figure out where this is. Alright, so it turns out that, uh... We were in the right spot, it's just she wasn't working there, so we're gonna head over to her house, which is right next to Max's. This should be it. Should be. I was, uh, I was Googling, because I was like, where, where's the Claire? Claire Bear. Uh, perhaps she's upstairs. We're just breaking into her house. I mean, this is a standard affair for Max. As we go on up here. Maybe she's in the bedroom? Perhaps? Unless we missed her. Unless she actually was at the cafe. She's across from the bar, um, basically in, like, a little stand. And we saw coffee. Which is the one. Hey, this is her. Here we go. I wish I could help you out, but fighting's scary, and I might get dirty. And I'd hate to be a nuisance to everyone. Sorry, but I'll have to say no. But there must be lots of unusual things outside town. I wonder what the trees are like, and what kind of flowers there are. If you see an interesting flower, could you take a picture of it for me, Max? I'd so love to see it. She said no this time, but if you show her a picture of something she's interested in, she'll probably give in. Nudge, nudge. Did you get a picture of an unusual flower? Let's see. Wow! This is amazing. So, these are the kind of flowers on the outside. Hmm, what should I do? Oh, okay. Take me with you. Claire has joined your party. Excellent. Welcome. Don't go anywhere too dangerous. Too late. It's already over. Hey, oh, what do you have over here? Paints, cup, and parasol. Did we already do that one? Did we already do paints, cup, parasol? Paints, cup, parasol. Paint, cup. I always forget everything but paints and cup. Let's do paints first under the letter P. -p, -p. P Pega. Paints. Uh, oh my god, I already, I already forgot. Give me a sec. All right, here we go. Parasol, get it in there. Invent. Oh, I've already invented it. Okay, so it's the clown body. Good. See what I mean? This is why I wish we had a recipe list, and it would just like compile everything, have a little check mark next to it if we made it or not. It'd be great. Also, is that like the Mona Lisa? It is. They just covered, colored over it. <laughs> I think I actually honestly think it is. And, like someone just was like, "All right, I need a, I need to draw a portrait of this uh, of Claire's mom." Or Greed's wife. And they're just like, alright, well, here we go. <laughs> oh my goodness. Is that actually the strat? You just go online and you're like, alright. Mona Lisa. Let's redraw it. Perfect. I like it a lot. Alright, let's go to the future real quick. So I can see how barren and sad this place is. Oh, by the way, this is a building episode. I should have pointed that out like 4 minutes and 30 seconds in, but... At the same time, I did warn you in the last episode, so ha. Huh. Oh, I love the soundtrack here. Huh? Who are you? This is the world's top research facility, Lunatic Wisdom Laboratory. Although this place may not look like much now, but we should be able to finish our research. Bruh, there's nothing here. But do not worry, for I am here. Ah, bah, bah, bah. What's that? He's even smiling while he's saving everyone. Oh, 
Someone needs to uh, remake uh, <laughs> My Hero Academia and replace All Might with Armstrong. It's the same voice actor in English, man. Just do it. It's easy, guys. Come on. So, so easy. <laughs> Actually, I kind of wonder if someone's done like memes like that already. That would be too good. All right, I'm just trying to get to my little save point here before we start building out. You may be like, hey, there's like no space to build. Actually, we build out onto the pier and uh, we build over the lake, which is pretty cool. That's actually the first time in a series where we've had to build over a lake, which is pretty neat overall. Uh, all right. Although it can feel a little limiting just because uh, essentially you're just building on these docks here. As you can see, here's your starting line. Wow. Uh, I don't think you can build anything like uh, before that little uh, flag system. Geostone downloading complete. You can make things and stuff. Excellent. Oh yeah, we're gonna need a lot of uh, metal, aren't we? Luna Lab, eight blocks of pier parts. Let's just skip over all this and then we'll go take a look at it in the cultural analysis. That's what we get for not doing anything yet. All right, Luna Lab Foundation restored. We need eight blocks of pier. Someone, anyone at all, residing in Venetio. 30 culture points. We'll probably just get that much culture points by making like a single house, but you know, it is what it is. Uh, Luna Lab 1. We need a red iron house. And Claire Bear. Oh god, now we gotta go kidnap Donnie. Lab 2 restored. We need a blue house and a Donnie. Lab 3, we don't know. Lab 4, we don't know. Lab... F uh, all labs, well, we don't know. Searchlights. Uh, okay, so really all we need is the two houses. Uh, lab 1 and Lab 2. So we got Claire, but we don't have Donnie. But we can worry about that later. We can go get Donnie in a little bit. Uh, what we really need is Piers. Uh, I say we get nine, so we at least have a square to work with at the beginning, and then we'll figure things out as we go along. I'm not, I'm not entirely sure how I want to build this, though. So maybe we won't do a square. I don't know, man. This makes it difficult. I think we gotta... Hmm. I think I just need a lot of wood. <laughs> but seriously, though, I need a lot. Uh, where is this? All right. How many can I make? Definitely not that much. Why does it even let me go that far? Oh, wait, never mind. That is the limit. That is the limit. How do I have so many rolling logs? I must have bought a bunch earlier. Uh, let's go with 15. Oh, well, yeah, why does it let me go that far? I guess, so 30 is the max, though. I guess that's a good way to tell how many peers you can have uh, in your life, in your relationship status, you know. I have this many peers. My peers know so much. All right, let me go buy some things. Uh, and also, while we're at it, let's figure out what we need for these houses. Uh, oh my gosh. Right, the iron stands and everything. All right, well, we want two how We need four houses, right? So we need a bunch of metal, a bunch of metal, a bunch of metal, and a bunch of metal. Gotcha. All right, it all makes sense now. These bridge blocks are also super cool. Oh, we might be able to do something with this. All right, maybe some sturdy rocks. Maybe some sturdy rocks. I never actually thought of doing any of this. Maybe we should um, look into some of this stuff, huh? Maybe we'll make a little bridgey bridge. Who knows? All right, I'm going to go on the train and buy some things. I'll be right back. All right, I guess while we're at it, we should probably also kidnap Eric. Oh, one thing uh, I forgot to do, and Rowan <laughs> made a good point. Uh, I forgot to switch my ally over to Cedric, who gives me a bonus to abs, I think it was, on my wrench. Um, not abs, but uh, you actually get plus one uh, synthesis point. And I totally forgot about that, and that's my bad. I was more so excited just to get more uh, loot going along, but yeah, totally. Make sure you have Cedric in your party when you're leveling your wrench, because, oh my god, that would help a lot. Uh, Alright, uh, make, make things and stuff. I like how I took a picture of that Mona Lisa. I totally forgot I even did it. It's just totally reactionary. Uh, we need to go to character. Eric, new status. It's been a while. 
acceptance I've actually had to kidnap his bombs. Thank you. Uh, we'll still chill with Borneo, though, for now. We gotta come up with some elite strats, though. We gotta, we gotta figure out how to make god-tier weapons in, like, under an hour. And then we can have those cool videos out, you know, where the ones with the big thumbnails and everything. Uh, with, like, the giant bits of text. It's like, become a god in under an hour. Ten billion thousand abs in under five minutes. With this one weird wacky strat. Alright. Let's talk to Conda. Uh, so, we're gonna need some sturdy rocks. Sturdy rocks from the sun. Uh, I don't think we need rough rocks yet. Uh, we'll round off our glass. Kinda got- I, w I wish I could just round off everything, but I guess not. Alright, here we go. This is where the- where the money is made. Oh wait, we can go- we can press R1! How did I not know about this? Alright, hold on. We need at least a lot. Thank you. And we can sell our bombs off to at least account for some of the cost here. Oh no, we're, we're maxed out on bombs. Okay. Uh, we'll save four. There you go. I pretty much made up for everything. It's not too bad. You know what? Yeah, we're selling the fish as well. Because I think we can get better food than uh, this fish here. Also, the fish kind of pay for themselves, don't they? Well, maybe not, because I think a carrot was like 60, 80. Ah, uh, who knows. Uh, oh, also, I think that Claire lady, she just sells us gift capsules if we need. So not particularly the most useful uh, NPC in the game. At least that's what the wiki said when I was looking into it. Alright, with all that purchase, let's go ahead and save. So we don't have to do that a second time. And we'll pray that we don't have to do more. Oh wait, I forgot to buy wood. <laughs> I bought a bunch of metal, but I didn't buy any wood. I am a fool! I will go do that. Alright, I need all your wood here, friend. I'll take a hundred. Thank you. Actually, I don't know if that's enough. I'll take 150. There you go. Now we're at 174. All right, back out onto the pier. Ah, feel that salty sea breeze as we come back out here and make ourselves a living. Uh, all right. I am very excited to see what we can do here because usually I just make a big ass square and uh, that's really about it. Do we go all in on 30? I don't think we go all in just yet. We'll do, we'll do 15, we'll do half. Because here's the thing, you can make more than you can place. For whatever reason, this game is weird like that. Alright, interesting. A pier actually takes up both the left and right. I was kind of hoping the piers were half size. But uh, it turns out I am not so fortunate uh, in this creation. Oddly enough, we can just go over here, though. To make it very confusing. Uh, Alright, do we just... What is the restriction here? Okay, I see now. All right, so what we'll do is we'll build this out this way, because my idea is, I wish this snapped a little bit tighter to the corners, but I guess it doesn't. Uh, my idea is I want to build outwards as well, and have a gap in the middle. That is my strat, and I'm stick, well, I take it all back, undo. All right, my strat is now, move it down a bit. <laughs> uh, actually, you know what? Do, how far out can we build anyway? That's what I would like to know. Is this is this like lined up or not? I can't. I honestly can't tell. I guess we can do this. Or maybe it doesn't work the way I think it does in terms of like determining how accurate this is. Okay, it's definitely not centered up though, right? I think we want to be like halfway. Oh, there we go. I can see the seams now. Perfect. All right, here we go. Aw, oh, man, seriously? Ah, oh, rude. Okay. We really do have to build super far out. Damn. Far out, dude. Now, the question is, do I have it go like this? Oh, wait, this is where we're going to build the bridge. That's right. That's right. Oh, wait, the bridge isn't what I thought it would be. <laughs> That's unfortunate. Maybe we can make a ramp going up to it, though. And it'll all be worthwhile in the end. That was the plan all along, friend. This is higher up than the... No, it's not okay. 
I don't know, maybe it'd be something fancy. I was kind of hoping it wouldn't, like, be stacked up on the ground like that, but I think gameplay restrictions or building restrictions are like, well, we don't want it to look like he just has floating blocks at the end of the day. Unless if we get, like, the singular uh, blocks here, that would be a little bit easier. I'm really, I'm really not sure myself. It's like the first time I've actually dealt with this sort of building structure. It's like the one thing I never use. Uh, well, since everything's made of wood, though, perhaps we make a couple of wooden stairs, huh? And then we place those bad boys down. Everything just blurs together for me in this game. I don't know why. All right. Uh, yeah. There you go. Ah. Uh, I don't think it looks great. <laughs> Maybe an iron stair? I wish there was like stone steps, you know? Stone stairs would actually be pretty dope. I like the iron stairs, they seem clean. Maybe we'll try those out. Let's clean this up a little bit. I think this place is probably, like has the most freedom in what you can do in terms of building. Like obviously you still have to make like build like iron houses because apparently they want everything to rust super hardcore, <laughs> but other than that, like, uh, you're basically making your own terrain, which is kind of the coolest thing. Uh, let's see. Oh, uh, wait, what? Oh, okay, I see, I see. I really wish I could just make a ramp, though, I'll be honest with you. Shoot, man. For some reason, the it doesn't want me to... Like, it'll snap to it, but, yeah, you gotta, like... You have to snap it this way, huh? That's what I mean, man. We want we want those stone steps. Alright, fine. I see how it is. We'll just do it like this. Seems a little bit weird, doesn't it? But I kinda... I don't like it. I don't like it. I'm looking at it. Wait, oh god. I'm trying to move out, apparently. I don't like it. Get it out of here. Yeah, I think we're gonna stick with the, uh, the wooden stairs. They take up just the right amount of space masking everything and then we just go back to making more piers hell yeah brother let's keep on going now how far back can we go not at all perfect <laughs> everything's going great uh i guess we just kind of have this one set out as such or if you want to really make it nice and even We do something like this, right? And now it all lines up beautifully. Hell yeah, dude. That's what I'm talking about. And then we clean this up because, gross, why would you ever attach your peers together and not have a fancy bridge like this? Exactly, that's what I was thinking. Of course. I like a little side pier over here, just hanging out. Make it look good. Uh, oh shit, we're already... We're already failing, because this was a little bit too far over. Okay, now we got it. Gimme, gimme, gimme. This is the game of make sure you don't overshoot. That's what this game has become. Okay, so, do we... Do we keep going out this way? I guess so. I want this place to seem weird. It is, it is the land of boats. How far out can we actually go? This is this is, uh, this is the distance, eh? Uh, oh, also. Let's clean up this, because I just noticed what it was. Oh, you can cancel out of the cleanup. That is a pain in the ass. I like it for the fact that it's tech, but, you know, I don't like it at all. Please, please don't do it. Okay, wait a minute. Now you're just cheating me, game. Oh my god. Having too much fun, the game said. Alright, here we go. <laughs> Alright, put on the magnetism. There we go. That's more like it. So I want this to extend as far out as I can get it. Just so to make it look kind of unique. Maybe we'll make another side platform, depending on how many piers we're allowed to make.
And the thing is, like, if the game's gonna allow me this much freedom, I wanna embrace the freedom. I wanna embrace the happiness. I might even wanna double up that bridge, to be honest. Um... Just unsure. Okay, how far over can we build over here? Just to right to around there, eh? Do I do I make this go outwards? No, because I think we want boats going along this left half. Then maybe we want houses on the right. And we are limited back here, right? We can't do anything with that. Okay. Perhaps we have one pier back here, just kind of hanging out, you know? Just kind of slap there in case we need, you know, some friendly stuff going on. I'm really not sure how else to put piers. <laughs> I wanna, I want them, but at the same time, I'm like, hmm, what do we do? Well, we are gonna need some boats coming out too. Ah, look at these block twos. Interesting. So why does the bridge block go so high up? But the block twos are so down low. I, that is something I am completely unsure about. This is gonna be like a 30 minute video of me just making peers, isn't it? I can't help it, man. I got an addiction and the only prescription is more peers, as we all know. I wanna try these singular bro brocks. These singular brocks real quick. All right, give me a sec. Let's try this out, because I want to... It doesn't really matter where it goes. Well, maybe around here. And then we'll take the singular block. Whoa, but it's lower down, rude. Wait a minute. Oh, we can stack them. Wait a minute. Hold the phone. Shut the front door. No way it's going to let me do this. Oh, no, it's not. It's not gonna let me do it. <laughs> so the strat there was gonna be that I, that I have it all attached to the side there, but I guess I can't do that. The game is not gonna let me. I thought for a second, just for a second, that we could be cool. For some reason, you can stack this as high as you want, but you can't, you can't go out. I don't know why that... Oh, wait, what? Okay, for a second, I thought I caught, but no. Trying to like spam it to see if I can uh, glitch it out, but no. Okay, worth checking, but unfortunate nonetheless that uh, we can't we can't be a little cheese ball strat. Try and figure it out. Um, man, that sucks. I, I feel like we just need a few more different types of blocks to help with making like an arch, you know, so boats can potentially go under this thing. This look, this is really all we get. This is the little baby arch, and that's it. I is that it? Is that the strap? I guess so. That's all they're gonna give us at the end of the day. Uh, maybe later on they'll be cool and give us like something a little different. Because you can only delete from top down, so that also kind of hurts a little bit. It hurts the soul, the dark soul, just a wee bit. This would be like our secondary residential shopping area. Who knows? Commercial, residential, whatever I decide to paint it with my brush. And there you go. We did it, everyone. We have crafted perfection. Now, I'm pretty sure we can make more piers, but this actually looks kind of neat. And I'm digging it. It's probably the most unique thing I've ever made on this map before. So I'm pretty excited. Uh, now all we need to do is make some more bridges. Uh, not bridges, but rather the, uh, these little staircases, rather. I feel like this is the way to do it, because you can just jump off the side and then you can climb up, so it doesn't take up as much space when you're going in. And we'll just make a bit more... Where's that wooden stairs, please? Alright, cool. Not really being hyper precise, and that's kind of just 
for the sake of the, the video, I think, but I think it's all right. Nice. Cool. Big cool, dude. Uh, all right, now. We need two iron hooses. Also, we'll need some, a bunch of uh, tiki torches. Pot torches. Those things will look great uh, out here. But uh, yeah, the number one thing is definitely make these houses. I haven't made any houses yet. Iron fence, iron stairs. Yeah, I've made iron houses. Wherever they may be. There you are. Okay, we need four of them. So we'll make four. We need four stands. We need three stairs more than what we currently have. And then we need, obviously, all the sheds in the world. Um, and then we'll make this boat, because I think it'll look nice. And apparently we can add a church as well. Not that I think we would need it. Uh, as for laundry, we'll make laundry. I don't think we need a well, but maybe we will. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know about that one, Chief. Ooh, iron lamps. Yes, we'll make four of those. What else are we looking for? Oh, yeah, trees. Well, on the middle of a beach, you typically would see, like, palm trees. I do think we have something along those lines. Yeah, there we go. Fruit trees. We'll get, like, well, that's not, it's not going to happen. We'll get four of them. Uh, we can, oh, we can also do some wooden gates. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Maybe we'll do, like, two. Get our torches out. We can make four for now. And I think that is everything we want. Okay. Excellent. Uh, let's get these iron houses ready to go first. I think that's the number one thing. It's got a little residential area back here. No real strat to how we put these down. Uh, yeah, I think we'll do, like, two houses back here. I haven't really thought about where the other houses are going to reside. But this seems okay to me. Maybe we'll do another house way back here. And then another house right at the entrance. Aha! See? There is wisdom to my madness. Totally. I can't perfectly center these. <laughs> uh, there we go. That's just gonna, oof, it's, it's gonna make everyone's brain melt, isn't it? The OCD lights are probably ticking. They're like, ah, it's not perfect. How dare? Does he not understand? All right, whatever. <laughs> oh God, that one's actually, yeah, that one's not, it's not centered. I wish there was a way to center it. There's no magnetism on these things. All right, here you go. It's as good as it's gonna get. Uh, and then I want to get this shop boat out. Oh, this seems cool. Um, I'm just gonna put it in an impossible spot that makes no sense. There you go. <laughs> uh, how did it get under the bridge? Nobody knows. Not even level five. Don't question it. All right. Just don't question it. It looks fine. <laughs> it doesn't even fit between the piers. They're, uh, they're stuck here in perpetual torment. This is what this is. Okay. Uh, we really don't need these to have stands, but I think it does help with the culture points overall, uh, even for the individual buildings themselves. So I think it's fine to do this. And then we'll have all our houses ready to go, which is pretty great. I like how these places are all prepped and ready to go for in case flooding happens, which is kind of nice. They are all prepared for any sort of strange tsunami, hurricane, sin attacks. And then I guess we now put down our fences. I'm really not sure, or stairs rather. Uh, I'm really not sure where Donnie should live. She like live at the entrance. He seems like that odd kid, right? So he probably wants to be a little bit more secluded and, like, private. While he's, like, tinkering away, working on stuff. Yep, 
get his uh, peace and quiet over in the middle of nowhere. Uh, all right, let's get our laundry. Everyone needs laundry. Oh, wait, apparently no one wants laundry. Damn it. Well, at least we can save it for the next area. Uh, okay. At our iron sheds. Yeah, I know, this all seems pretty... Like, everything is just gonna be the same. <laughs> but the thing is, like, what else am I supposed to add to these damn things? I guess you could maybe add, like, a chimney. Or something. But then I think you, you destroy the integrity of it all. Do you not? Uh, get the iron lamps, potentially? No iron lamps. All right, I guess we gotta put the torches out then. Shoot. That's unfortunate. Get those pot torches. Originally, I was gonna have the pot torches, like, lining the entire, uh, setup here, but I guess not. Like, the entire, like, entrance to the massive pier. Cool. All right, now all the houses are lit up. Got ourselves some fruit trees, which apparently can grow off of the docks. Just don't think about it. That is the most important thing. Why can it? Why can I place it on the docks, but I just can't? All right, you know what? Fine. That is the strat, apparently. Yeah, it's just the strat is don't worry about it, kid. Of course palm trees can grow here. What, are you crazy? Where else would they grow? On the ground? <laughs> idiot. What do you think you're doing? Ground trees? Look at this kid over here. More like you're grounded, kid. Back to your room. Got him. Destroyed. Destroyed that kid's whole career. All right, I think that's everything except for the wooden gates. I think I just wanted like a wooden gate at like the entrance here. Yes, ham fist players in the game. Oh okay, yeah, this was a lot cooler when I thought about it. Uh, <laughs> shit. I, I, that's why I wish the piers were a bit smaller, dude. All right, fine. We'll do something along the lines of this. You can only go this far into Donnie territory. Then it's open to pew pews from his weapons. He'll get you. Destroy your very being. All right, I think that is what it is. I don't think I can really think of anything else. I mean, other than I guess we could get some benches up here on the pier. Uh, and then, oh man, there's not even like wooden boxes. I think wooden boxes would actually help a lot. I mean, obviously, like, the fishermen are gonna want some, like, some seating arrangements, right? If potentially I can get some pot. Oh, wait, I don't have any more sticky clay. Crap! And of course, we need that for other things. Uh, potentially, though, like, I don't know about, like, a barn, but uh, actually, like, a storehouse or something would also work. Uh, ooh, iron chimneys? I don't even think we can place iron chimneys on these big things. Let's just try it out, though, just so we know for sure. <laughs> and, and create a terrible mistake. Yeah, yeah, we, we literally can't do anything. Okay. Well, that's our town for now. Uh, until we get more stuff going on. So we got lab one, lab two. So we need red and blue. So we gotta go paint. We don't got any blue, but we do got red. I think Claire can uh, chill out here. There you go, lovely little red house. I love it. You can also paint the uh, the bottom here, it seems, but I'm not gonna do it. I don't think it really would look that good. And let's go get uh, Claire in here, I guess. There you go. Might be some things we can take pictures of in here too. Yeah, like the engine. Small generator. I think that's a new one. Laundry. Small generator. Some lady named Claire. Wait, bananas! My friend Pedro. 
Yo, wait, whoa. Okay, that's the first time we've actually gotten a picture of banana. I think. Look, okay, so we got boxes over here, but you're not gonna give us any boxes. Egg-shaped transmitter? What the hell? <laughs> you're not gonna give us, like, barrels and boxes to just toss wherever we want? Let's see how it is. When it comes to houses, the sturdier the better, right? Smart lass. Smart lass indeed. Oh, that's not so bad. Adds to the enemy's rage tip. That's definitely very good if you're not doing enough damage. Like, dude, the amount of enemies I make rage at me is unbelievable. This is a pretty cool town, man. I'm liking it so far. So now we just gotta go kidnap Donnie. And then, uh... Also buy some blue paint. And then we'll throw Downy in there. I think that'll look pretty good. I'm gonna try and see if we can figure out how to liven up the the pier itself, though. Because I think overall... Like... <sighs> see how empty this is? I want it to be filled with stuff. I might make more, more shopping boats, or maybe we'll get more boats as it goes on. Because we're only halfway done the dungeon. Um, so we really can only do so much, but... Overall, I want to feel it to feel pretty homey because we're gonna be fishing here, too, right? So we want to have like Boxes barrels anything really that we can place down Makes me wish this game came out on PC because I'm sure the modding scene for like building uh, All this stuff would be really really cool Yeah, I think this actually looks really cool. I think this is uh, my favorite looking pier I've made in the game again Usually all I do is I make a giant square like a 9 by 9 square and just slap everything down So this playthrough I've been trying different things even doing makeshift bridges, <laughs> which uh, look a little bit questionable. Well, it's something else, right? It's something a little bit different. Even if it's not perfect. But uh, ladies and gentlemen, I think we'll wrap up the video here. In the next episode, we'll go kidnap Donnie. And then we will head to the future and see how everything is looking. Also, we take a picture of this yet. Palm tree, excellent. So there are palm trees. We just can't grow them. Um, anywhere other than on the wood, because it makes perfect sense. Just don't think about it. <laughs> uh, regardless, I'm Magnum101, and I'll see y'all next time. If you liked the video, consider giving me a like. Helps give it a little bit of uh, uh, YouTube algorithm juice. And uh, yeah, see you next time.